Just so people know, it's a very good idea to do a uh, Control Shift Escape or Control Alt Delete and find the t3main.exe. Right click on that, click Set Affinity, and uh, select only one CPU core. Otherwise, you might get issues. Disk, disk. Cry, brethren, for the betrayer is come. Your hands will be crippled, and you will perish as the wretched outcasts, the bleak unwritten. And you will know the face of the destroyer. <laughs> So, welcome to Thief Deadly Shadows, Frozen Foxy's first Let's Play. Thanks to Skinner and Catranonis for introducing me to this indirectly through their videos. Let's get to setting up some options. So, for me, I always like to make sure that my crouch button is set to control, as you can notice right here. I just enjoy that because it's in quite a few other games. So instead I don't have a creep button at all. I've never really used the creep button. Shift is a walk button, that's all I really need. Okay, now let's start up a new game. I got a tip last night from my fence, Heartless Perry. A nobleman named Lord Julian had some sort of quarrel and showed up at a local inn well after nightfall and in a foul mood. He's carrying a velvet bag about the size of a man's fist and it never leaves his sight. Sounds likely to be valuable, but I'll know for sure when I steal it from him. Perry sent over a floor plan of the place, the Blue Heron Inn. Finding his lordship won't be hard. His room number will be in the guest register, if I can get to the front desk to read it. The inn will have guards, but not as many as a private estate. That should make things easy, which is one of the reasons I'm willing to try it without knowing for sure what the take will be. Lord Julian is so protective of that bag. There's got to be something of value in it. Normally, I like to do expert difficulty, but since this is the training mission, we can only do it on normal difficulty. Too bad. Anyway, we can also check out our gear over here and notice that we have uh, 10 of our water arrows, a lovely blackjack, and a dagger, which I uh, will only use later in the game, hopefully. Anyway, let's get to it. <laughs> 